Yo, what's up guys? Welcome back. Uh, this is Theo here. Welcome to Codecademy Learn HTML and CSS Part 1. So, um, we're going to continue our learning and uh, learn some HTML and CSS. This will be Part 1. I'm going to click Start here. And uh, so, I mean, this tutorial really just assumes that you have a very basic understanding of HTML. HTML is hypertext markup language. It allows you to decorate your web pages. The structure of it in CSS is castigating style sheets, which, as the name denotes, allows you to give style and uh, sort of appearance to your HTML. Uh, just like note, it says nine lessons, so let's get started. So it says in the code ed editor to the right, type your name between H1 and then press 1. Okay. Um, so where should we put it? I guess we can put it right here, make an H1. I'll just say Theo. Let's click run. And there we have our name. There you go. Showed up. Cool. Um, next one up. Talks about doc type HTML. This is basically to tell the browser uh, that you're going to be using HTML. And it's really just for semantics. Let's go ahead and add this. Uh, doc type HTML. So this is just the document type HTML. Let's run that. Awesome, pretty simple. Uh, so next, the next tag that comes after that is the HTML tag. You can sort of see the structure. And uh, so we'll go ahead and type this out. So we have HTML, and you notice you know, the sort of structure of you have this open caret, and then to close it, you have this slash, and then you write the name of the tag. All right, let's go ahead and run that. So again, we're starting sort of from the ground up. Uh, I don't know what happened to that HTML. HTML and we run that one more time. I don't know why it got rid of it. All right, cool. Uh, next one up. This sort of just explains everything. So this is the opening tag I talked about, and then you have your content, whatever it could be. It could honestly be another tag inside of here. It doesn't matter. This whole thing is called uh, an element because this is you know one sort of unit that works together. Uh, so this is the opening tag. This angle bracket and the slash denotes the closing tag. And again, this is the type of tag. This is a P. <laughs> Sorry about that. This is a P for paragraph. And uh, great. Uh, okay, cool. So now five. We have the head tag after HTML. So out of here, we're gonna put scripts. We're gonna put style sheets. We're gonna put you know metadata about the document. Uh, we're gonna put our title, or whatever it might be. Just very you know specific stuff. Let's go ahead and run that. But again, you know you can read this. Give some more context. Awesome. Uh, next up, guys, we're going to add a title, like I said, and we're just going to say uh, Hello World. And this is what's going to show up at the top of your web page, like on Google Chrome if you're using a tab. Um, that's what this is going to show up there. So we should be able to, this is not going to show it here, but let me see. No, it won't show it there. But uh, if, you, um, if you click on the tab you're on right now and you look at the text on the tab, that should be the title. All right. So next up, um, here, here it shows you right here. This is what I mean. This is the tab, and this title is Jessica's portfolio site. So whoever you know structured this page, web page, this is what they put. So, you, but you can change this to anything you want, and this is what the browser will interpret as as the title. Awesome. Uh, next up, guys, we're gonna add the body. So the body goes after the head, and inside of the body, it's gonna go all of our content you know, all of our HTML, all of our, uh, you know, document content. Awesome. All of our code. Now let's go ahead and run that. And next up, guys, let's just review review what we learned. We learned about the doc type, the HTML, the head tag, the title, and the body. Let's go ahead and add all these things. So let's go ahead and add doc type, HTML. Okay. Let's add our HTML tag. And I'm going to show you how to indent these things real quick. HTML, let's add a head tag, so it's a hierarchy. HTML goes ahead of head. We're going to close off our head tag. All right. Um, we're going to add a title. We're just going to call this uh, my first web page. Again, you can make this anything you want. Our head. Uh, we're going to add a body. The body's going to be on the same indentation as the head because uh, they're siblings. Uh, next up, 
we are going to uh, add this h1 hello world you can see down there and that should do it for us so let me just type that in there for you guys and what does it say missing html oh my god let's close off our html tag let's go ahead and run this this should give us everything we want awesome so there you guys have it up next guys we'll be moving on to common html elements to learn about some of the most common html elements used to add text images and more to web pages so cool you guys can sort of see where we're going and uh if you like the video make sure to give it a like thumbs up please subscribe and support the channel it means a lot so thanks for watching have a great day and i'll see you in the next video take care